plans to extend the Westfield Shopping Centre in West London, creating thousands of jobs and hundreds of new homes, have been approved by the Mayor. But the idea has also come under fire for only making a fraction of the new homes affordable for many Londoners. Well, Alice Bandekravi is outside Westfield for us this evening to tell us more. Alice. That's right, Assad. Westfield opened up here six years ago, and in that time it's gone from strength to strength, of course, opening up a new centre in East London by the Olympic Park, and now pushing ahead with a £1 billion expansion, uh, including new shops. Uh, so, of course, thousands of jobs are in the pipeline. New homes are also going to be built, and Westfield has committed to building 1,300 new homes, of which 160 are going to be what's described as affordable. Now, that's just 12%. And the Mayor's own time target is that 40% of homes built by new developments should be uh, described as affordable. So the local MP uh, has expressed his disappointment with the terms of the deal. I hope we can either persuade or in some way uh, uh, insist that Westfield go back and look at this again. If they're going to be a good neighbour uh, in West London, they ought to think about not just the people who shop there, but the people who live there. Now, Westfield themselves uh, have said that the terms of the deal are the best that they can do in the current economic climate. And City Hall have been quick to defend their approval of this expansion. This is an extremely expensive site to build on. And as I say, the main advantage for our point of view is jobs. Uh, and we weigh jobs and, and housing in the balance when we make these decisions. But it is about the overall economic benefit to the city. Now, these plans are expected to take place within the next three years. Uh, but given that in the last week, uh, Labour won control of the formerly Tory-led council, uh, we may well see Hammersmith Council looking to renegotiate the terms of this deal to increase the number of affordable homes to be built. OK, Alice Bader-Cravey at Westfield, thanks very much.